Hi students, welcome. In this video, we will study about the difference between dynamic viscosity and kinematic viscosity. Here, dynamic viscosity is represented by the symbol mu, okay, mu, and kinematic viscosity is denoted by the symbol nu, that is here nu, okay. Now, here we will see the first definition of dynamic viscosity and kinematic viscosity. So here definition of dynamic viscosity is dynamic viscosity is the ratio of shear stress and velocity gradient or we can also call also define as the dynamic viscosity is the ratio of shear stress to the rate of angular deformation or rate of shear strain okay now here see the symbol of this dynamic viscosity symbol is mu mu is equal to shear stress upon velocity gradient shear stress is denoted by tau and velocity gradient is denoted by du upon dy and here this here further dynamic viscosity is equal to shear stress upon rate of angular deformation or rate of shear strain so here this this is denoted by shear stress is tau and here rate of angular deformation or rate of shear strain is denoted by d theta upon dt okay now see here kinematic viscosity is the ratio of dynamic viscosity to the mass density so here the symbol of dynamic viscosity is mu and the symbol of mass density is rho so tau so here kinematic viscosity that is nu nu is equal to mu that is dynamic viscosity upon rho that is mass density now see further here we will see now here the SI units of both that is second here we will see SI unit here also second will be SI unit so see here now we will take mu is equal to tau upon du upon dy that is velocity gradient the here unit of tau that is shear stress is here Newton per meter square is the unit of shear stress further into 1 upon we have du upon dy that is velocity gradient the unit of velocity gradient is per second so now this becomes newton and this as goes upward so here newton second per meter square this is the unit of dynamic viscosity and this is also called as here pascal second because newton per meter square this newton per meter square is pascal okay so here this becomes pascal second and further we can simplify it as as we know here again we will simplify this that is mu is equal to tau upon du upon dy tau is force upon area so so here tau that is shear stress is given by force upon area newton force is the unit of force is newton unit of area is meter square so here newton per meter square unit of shear stress now here into we have 1 upon du upon dy now we will put the here we will put now uh, units now no further we will simplify this again as force is given by mass into acceleration upon area mass force is given by mass into acceleration so here we have written m into a that is mass into acceleration upon area we have here next we have into du upon dy now we will put the sim uh, here units of all these term all these term so here unit of mass is kg unit of acceleration 
due to gravity sorry acceleration is here we have meter per second square okay further here we have unit of area that is this one into 1 upon meter square and again we have here the area the unit of this term that is 1 upon dy upon du upon dy so here 1 upon 1 upon s now we will simplify here first we will re rewrite this whole kg meter upon second square meter square into we have this s goes upward so here we have s now we will simplify this new mu that is mu that is dynamic viscosity is equal to we have now this meter gets cancel and this square gets cancel this second gets cancel and here this second this square gets cancel so here we left with here now kg per meter second this is the this is also the si unit of dynamic viscosity okay so here see the unit or si units of dynamic viscosity are here first is our this unit that is newton second per meter square second unit is pascal second okay and third unit is our this one that is kg per meter second now further see now we will see the cgs unit okay now for first we will see the all dynamic viscosity units so here now we have third point cgs unit okay cgs unit of dynamic viscosity is here poise poise one poise okay the poise here the unit of cgs unit is a unit of dynamic viscosity is poise and it is also written as dyne second per centimeter square okay now see here again we will write down here fourth here one poise is equal to point 0.1 newton second per meter square okay now students we will see the si unit of kinematic viscosity so here we will write down here nu is equal to mu upon rho now we will put the units so here unit of mu is here as we know here kg per meter second so we will write down unit of uh, dynamic viscosity that is mu is equal to kg per meter second and now we will write down the unit of rho that is mass density is equal to density is equal to mass upon volume so here we will write down first this mu upon mass upon volume so here we will write down mass uh, the unit of mass is kg and the unit of volume is meter cube so now here we will simplify this kg upon meter second into we have this meter cube will go upward so meter cube upon kg so now we will cut this so here we will read out rewrite this whole term so here we have new is equal to kg per meter second into meter cube upon kg now here see this kg kg will cancel out this meter will cancel out and this term left with meter square so here we have now the unit of kinematic viscosity is meter square per second okay the so here the si unit of kinematic viscosity is meter square per second okay now see here we will see now cgs unit 
थर्ड वन इज सी जी एस यूनिट ऑफ काइनेमेटिक विस्कोसिटी सो सी जी एस यूनिट ऑफ काइनेमेटिक विस्कोसिटी इज सेंटीमीटर स्क्वेयर पर सेकेंड और वी कैन कॉल इट एज स्ट्रोक ओके नाउ फर्दर हियर फोर्थ इज वन स्ट्रोक स्ट्रोक इज इक्वल टू टेन रेज माइनस फोर मीटर स्क्वेर पर सेकेंड ओके सो स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस वीडियो वी हैव अंडरस्टूड अबाउट द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द डायनेमिक विस्कॉसिटी एंड द कैनेमेटिक विस्कॉसिटी थैंक यू स्टूडेंट्स फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो लाइक शेयर एंड कमेंट फॉर दिस वीडियो एंड सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल थैंक यू